Shalom everyone, Josh Joy here. And this morning, I want to share a cute little story on the goodness of Hashem that transpired yesterday. So I was at a petrol station here locally, and I was over getting a beverage at the fountain drink machine, right? Well, a couple, a number of years older than myself walked in. They're going to get some beverages as well. And the gentleman just off the cuff goes, GD gas prices are so high. This, I don't know, something like this hell's got to stop or something. And I looked at the gentleman and said, well, first of all, the Lord will not damn anything I tried for 36 years. He didn't damn anything. But he will bless things if you ask him to bless something. And secondly, I know the world wants hell, but myself personally, I'm aiming for Shamaim, for heaven. And as I was speaking to this gentleman, explaining how the Lord works and his goodness, he goes to say, well, man, after spending $100 for fuel, I should get a free drink. Well, I didn't make mention, and all I said was, <laughs> I didn't make mention of anything. All I said was, you know, sir, the Lord provides. We parted ways, they go to the counter, and they're standing behind another individual who's checking out at the time. Well, I walk up to the other side of the counter with my beverage and go, it's good to see y'all ladies, have a nice day, <laughs> and proceeded to leave the store. Yes, I am very fortunate that the people around here understand I do a lot to help my neighbors get through because of the financially challenging times. And yes, I am very fortunate I can get a free fountain drink. Uh, you know, that's the grace of Haya. That's that's what he provides. And going back to the counter moment, you know, as I said bye to him, that guy just turned and looked at me and he's like just dumbfounded. Like, wait, he didn't pay for his drink. <laughs> All I'm saying, peep, fear hall, y'all, he will provide. <laughs> Be blown away, peep. I'm out of here. Shalom. <laughs>